Guys, if you haven't yet, then subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon and never miss a video from Techo Friendly. Guys, before getting to the video, let's give a big shout out to PureVPN for sponsoring this video. PureVPN gives you complete online freedom by providing enhanced online security and privacy by encrypting and switching your IP address. PureVPN provides 256-bit data encryption with 99.99% uptime and provides features such as automatic protocol selection, split tunneling and an internet kill switch. They also have a zero log policy which means they won't log any of your web activity whatsoever. They also have a 7 days money back policy which means if you are not satisfied with any of the features of pure vpn you will get a full refund of your money check out pure vpn's free and premium products by heading to the website linked in the description below hey guys once again welcome to Taco friendly so today i'm going to show you guys how to fix a very simple and basic error that you guys get when you try to run a web application in netbeans so let's see what the error is so here is a simple uh, netbean java code web application code that is designed to uh, display to do right content in the web browser whenever you run it so let's run this code so whenever i run this code i'm getting a warning which says could not access the url through the external browser check the browser configuration so guys this error is basically happening because the netbeans can't uh, is unable to uh, read the inbuilt chrome browser that that is in, installed in your system so the fix is pretty much simple so all you have to do is go to the tools menu in the menu bar then go to options then go to web browser here it is selected default system browser and as i told you the, the netbeans is unable to read the uh, default browser of your system so uh, here are some of the browsers that are installed in my system currently so uh, it will show the web browsers uh, that are installed in your system uh, so here are some of the multiple uh, choices so here i'm selecting chrome because i like chrome i want chrome to show the output of my code so i selected chrome now click on apply now guys don't forget to click on apply because uh, if you don't click on apply and directly click, click on ok uh, the changes won't take place and uh, you, you may get the error again so click on apply then click on ok now let's try to run this uh, code again and uh, hopefully it will show the output in the chrome browser and uh, <clears throat> There you go guys, it's showing the to do right content output uh, as I told uh, you earlier uh, as the output. So guys that's it for my this video, I hope you like my video, if you like my video give me a thumbs up and if you didn't like my video you know what to do. Uh, also guys if you have any doubt uh, regarding any of the step that I performed right now feel free to share it down in the comment section below. Uh, also guys stay tuned for the java tutorial series that I plan to uh, you know start and uh, do check out my channel and if you like my content subscribe to me and click on the notification button so that you don't miss out on my future videos uh, so that's it for this video see you guys in my next video till then take care bye bye